Hey everybody, Arnaldo Offman here of LED Video Wall Manuals. Today we're going to talk about replacing the module. Now, in the case of the Iris R3 from Blizzard, there's four modules and they're held together with magnets, thankfully, versus screws or anything else, which makes for an easy on-the-fly replacement, especially if I'm in the middle of setting up for an event. So you're going to see in the back of the panel, there's like a little handle. So what I do is I just push with one hand and hold the panel with the other and it just pops right out. Now each module is specific to each quadrant in the panel. So you can't just mix and match left top with right bottom. So make sure you call Blizzard and they'll send you the right part or whoever your LED manufacturer is. So now with the case of the Blizzard, it makes it super easy. There's four little tabs on each side. So what I do is I just align that tab down at the bottom and then I make sure the tab on the right hand side goes in as well. And then you can feel the magnets, just push it in. I don't let go of it yet. I make sure that top tab right there aligns perfectly. And now on the left hand side, that's where the pins are. And I gotta be careful not to bend the pins. But if those four little tabs align properly, it's gonna snap right in. So if you guys have any questions, comments, etc., please leave them in the comments below. Thanks again for watching. Have a great night and God bless. Hey, I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you want to see more like it, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Gear it first, honest reviews, incredible gig logs, lots of tips and tricks, and more tutorials than any other YouTube channel. I guarantee it or your money back.